Hey guys, what's going on? Drax here with another series for you guys today. This is a brand new game called The Untitled Game, or TUG. It's made by Nerd Kingdom, and you can see right down here that is an early alpha. So yeah, let's jump right in and get started. Um, I don't have any worlds. Uh, cancel. Let's do um, world save name. Let's do Drax LP. World Seed will be Draxer's World. Oh, that's World. World. <laughs> Alright, so new game. Let's jump right in and see where this game takes us. It's loading, taking a second. There we go. Okay. So I was turned on to this game by Zuljin. He's been playing it, and I thought it was really cool looking. Got some pumpkin vines here. Turn down my audio and my headphones, because it's really loud. We'll break those, we'll grab some vines, and just kind of look around a little bit. Let's go up to the top of the hill here. So not a whole lot of vegetation around. I mean, I mean we got a lot of vegetation, but not really anything useful. So we might have to do some traveling here the first night. Uh, so this is kind of a open world sandbox game. I can usually destroy the terrain once I get some some stuff. Uh, what is this? Ghost mushroom. So you can see down at the bottom of the screen there's health, stamina, and energy. And then right above that when I hover over something I get a uh, little thing that says what it is. And then I can open my inventory and I can sprint. Not into a ravine, that'd be bad. Let's see. I actually think I'm gonna jump down here. What's this little guy? Large clover? Take some more vines. So yeah, you can actually craft stuff in this. Um, there's different things you can build. Can't do anything with that. And so I really want to get to a place where I can find some decent wood. Um, actually, these things are not useful to me yet because I can't break them. Oh look, a rock. Okay, so this is a hammer rock. And this is used for um, breaking other rocks or breaking things that you couldn't break with your hands. And I can't break it with that. So let's try and break the big rock. Okay, so you can see the rock that I have has durability and then the big rock has durability. So we got another hammer rock, we got an axe rock, some cobblestone, some pebbles. I don't need the pebbles. Pick rock. Cool. So now if I come back over to this this thing with my axe rock, ooh, it takes quite a bit of durability to break this thing down. And what was that? The cane shaft. Now I've done some research into this before I started playing it. I played a little bit myself and watched Z play and then I read a, quite a bit on the wiki. And it looks like there's... Um, Quite a bit that can be crafted. Still a lot of bugs here and there. And then I am looking forward to a... A uh, t -t 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 multiplayer. I think that'll be a lot of fun. Get some of the guys from Hypermind in on it. So... Just seeing what's around. Ooh, a stick. Cool. Okay, so now that I have the stick, I can actually craft some stuff. So I'm going to take the stick put it down. I'm going to take some vines, put one of those down, and I'm going to take the axe and I'm gonna hit G. And G is what you use to craft stuff. So if I put it down and pick it back up, I have a axe. Very cool. Okay. So now I'll just pick up another hammer rock just because. Oh look, there's another one of those little sticks. Okay. Hit that. Pick up you. I'm going to place it down, we're going to get some vines, place it down. That little leaf right there above the screen scared the living daylights out of me. And a pick rock, and we're going to hold G again. Aha, and now I have a pick. Cool. Um, I want this here. Okay. So, let's see. There's quite a few rocks around, but I really want to find something with a little more wooded area. Looks to be some trees over that way, so we'll give it a shot. Flat rock, I'll take that. 
And you were an acacia sapling. Cool. I'm not going to pick up the sh Well, I guess I'll pick up the shaft. Why not? Can I have that? Gimme, gimme. Gimme. So we'll... You know, normally I'm the type of person that gathers everything and just has it stored away. But the storage system in this game is not quite implemented yet. And so, like, there's no chests, there's no backpacks. I mean, they're in the game. They're just not really usable at this point. So, uh, so yeah, we have to look into some other ways of storing our items and keeping them where they need to be. So it looks like we got some trees over this way. This might not be a horrible spot. Doesn't look like the best. Ooh, 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 ooh. pumpkin. Pumpkin will be really good for food. And then we got some seeds that I can have for later. Break that acacia sapling with my fist. So does these stack? No. Oh, no. I still got room in my take. Vines are one of those things that you can pretty much take a good chunk because you will use vines like none other. Another good thing are these wooden handles. They are really good too because you will use those for a lot of things. I'm going to let the pumpkin line stay there because it can regrow and I think that'd be nice. So okay we're, we're kind of going along here and I'm not really seeing what I'd like to see. So maybe this is a bad seed. Let's see, let's look at this little ravine area here. Like an underground cavern type thing. That's kind of cool. Ooh, you hear that? You can hear like the wind going through the cavern. That's pretty dang neat. Let's see. Ooh, there's another pumpkin. Let's go get it. This one I'm not going to eat right away. I'm going to take it because we might need to eat it later, especially if we don't find a place to live right away. We're, we're going to want that. So my plans for the series, um, you know, I was talking to Z last night, and I want to be kind of a nomad, you know, kind of travel, live in one area, move around, live in another area, move around. Um, or I could, you know, build up in one spot and just continue to build. Um, but I, I don't really know. I think we'll just kind of see how it plays out with this seed that I got. It doesn't really look like there's too much that's plentiful. So, ooh, hey, I want you again. Thank you. So we might just have to, you know, like, deal. Oh, yeah. Jump that clearing. Did you see that? Like a boss. All right. So let's see. It looks like there's some more stuff up this way. This might not be a bad, or getting to be a bad spot. Huh. Oh, am I going to make it? Yep, okay. So another thing about this, um, I'm sure it's just not an implementation yet, but there is no water in this world whatsoever. Oh gosh, I fell. So like no water, no lava. Um, your basic tools are all you really have. There's no, as far as I Dude, a water work tree? You see how big this tree is? This tree is huge. It'll take forever to chop down. But there's supposedly adding, like, uh, he was telling me all kinds of uh, metallurgy and stuff and new terrain gen, and it just really looks like a game that would be very, very cool. And I'm very, very excited to see where it goes and, you know, how it takes off. Whoa. Can I get out of here? I'm gonna get out of here. I didn't mean to fall down. What do you drop? More vines? How many vines do I have? Oh, I have a ton of vines. Jeez. This is a cool little cave area. Lily? Um, where's my axe? Ooh. Dropped a big leaf. Cool. And you. Okay, so we're kind of stuck in this cave at the moment. I'd really like to get out of here if that was at all possible. Um. 
Can I jump up here? Who? Oh yes, I made it. Okay, cool. So this thing right next to me is a, a wood table. Um, there's like stone tables and stuff, and you can hear it like hums. And there's supposed to be some things that you can craft with it, but I have not really got into that yet. So I'm sure we will. Okay, so there's a lot of woods around here, but this is awfully creepy. I'm gonna pick up these gourds. I think that I can eat the gourds. So I definitely want to pick those up. Save them for later. Aha! This is the area that I want to be in. This looks nice. This looks really nice. Um, give me that. I like this area a lot. It's a lot more wooded. There's a lot of things around. There's bamboo, and then there's aspens, and then this should be a fruit wood. Oh, that's cool. What is this tree over here? A maple. Yes. This is, yep, this is it. This is where we're going to call our home, and so I just need to pick out an area. This is not a bad spot. Um, let's see, let's look over here. Could go into the mountain there. Huh. Okay, yeah, this is not bad. Let me eat something real quick. Whoop. Thank you. Put that back. Yes, this does not look like a bad spot at all. I think... You know what we'll do, maybe not yet, but eventually, because I like this spot right here. I think this is a really nice spot. Uh, we could dig into the mountain. So if I hit that, nope, if I hit that one, we can come over here. And it gets dark, but hey. Why can't I? Why, why, why don't you let me dig into you? Huh. Okay, let's break this rock. Did you, oh, you give me a sword one? Take the cobble. Are you an axe rock? No, you're a pick rock. Pick rocks are good too, I just, I'm looking for an axe rock at the moment. Oh yeah, there's that one. Um, Let's take some of these. We'll put them over there. We'll take these. Put them over there, and we'll take our vines. So we got a ton of vines, holy cow. Put our leaves. We got food there. Oh, I don't want to put down our cobble, but we'll put down our hammer rocks. Our flat stone. Let me pick up my pebbles. Put them over there. Um, we got that thing, put it over here. So really, at the moment, this is the only way to kind of take one of you and put it over here. And we're actually going to make a knife. Cool. Thank you. Um, so yeah, that's really the only way to kind of store your stuff is to just put it all together and hope for the best, you know. So we got gourds. Um, I'll put my gourds down in this hole. Ooh, they put off light. That's kind of cool. Uh, crook. And then we got this thing. Okay. And then we got another hammer rock. Where did I put the hammer rocks? I put them over here. So we'll hold on to one of them. And then I wanted pebbles over there. I'll keep the cobble and then the pick rock. All that stuff. Like I said, I'll keep the cobble. We'll put a hammer rock over there. We'll put our pick rock. Where do I want the pick rock? Put the pick rock right there. And the pebbles, I was putting the pebbles over there. So now I want one of you. No, actually I don't. I want one of you. And one of you. Put that there. Oh, no, hey, I like that. Put that down, and then a vine. And this, I think, I think will make me a shovel. Yes, okay, cool. Now let's see if we can dig into this hill. No. Hmm. 
Oh, okay. Oh, yes, okay. So we should be able to dig in, kind of, you know, do what we need to do here. All right, so we need really some light. That's what we need at the moment because it's, it's pretty, pretty dark actually. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna chop down some trees. Yeah, that'll be good. Chop down the aspen and when it falls, you get some stuff, but you also have the actual log that you can chop up and take apart as well. So we'll do that. Um, is there another one? Yep, I'll take an aspen. Cool. Give me that, that, and we'll chop that up. Okay, cool. I gotta say, guys, this is a pretty fun game. I gotta admit, it's something different. You know, I'm a huge Minecraft person on my channel, but this is close but different enough to where it's really intriguing. Um, the, the crafting mechanic to me is completely different. Really excited to kind of see where it goes. So we should be able to come up here. And I want to take three of these. One, two, three. Can I... Oh, I might need my flat rock. Can I have my flat rock? I can't remember exactly how this is supposed to work. Um, do I need a stick? Nope. Do I need a branch? Okay, how about some more chopped wood? No? Um, can't make anything with that. What about some vines? Okay, I could have swore that I made a fire last time. Let's look here real quick. I had this open before, but I want to open it again. I'm sorry, guys. I don't normally do this. So, um, pebbles. Okay, so we need logs. One, two, three. We got our flat rock, and we need some pebbles. Okay, let's put some of these over here. Maybe it's the hammer rock. What? Urgh. What am I doing wrong, guys? I don't understand. Okay, let's put the vines down. Let's put the shafts down. And then let's put the sticks where they need to go. I'm going to put our wood over here with the flat rock, like so. And then the round stone. I don't know. I mean,. I assume that that's what it is. Maybe it's the pebbles. Maybe it's picky. I don't know. Well guys, that's going to be it for today. Um, I believe that I've done just about all I can do for at the moment. I'm going to need to gather some more resources and try to figure out how to build a fire because this is just frustrating. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Looking at the wiki, I might need two of these. <gasps> yes! Look at it! I made fire! Woot! Okay, yes. 
great success. Oh, yes, guys. Um, oh, wait. I'm going to put that next to it. Hold G. Oh, yes. I have, I have light and torches. Oh, we were getting ready to leave and quit. Now we have light over here. I can see what I'm digging into. Awesome. Okay. Great, guys. Great. Oh, yes. I'm excited now. Okay. So put that down and put that down. We're going to craft up a couple more. Okay. So cool. All right. We're going to put this guy on the other side of the table over here. And then this one I'm going to put out here a little bit just to kind of give us a perimeter of stuff. Go ahead and eat our pumpkins. Oh, we had pumpkin seeds. Yep, there they are. All right, guys. Well, that's going to be it for today. I'm so glad that we got that actually figured out. That's really, really good. <coughs> Excuse me. I'm sorry. Um, I'm, I'm excited. I can't wait to finish playing this with you guys. Or not finish playing with. Continue to play this with you guys and see where it takes us. But for now, my name is Drax, and I will see you next time. Bye!